Hey guys, Nix is me here. Uh, like immediately after I ended that episode, I started this one. So at the last episode, I started this one. So now I'm here with more Biting of Isaac. I'm playing as Kane. Uh, start my timer. And I've got this little fetus to kill. Again, this game. This game. So wrong. So wrong. And the reason I'm focusing on that is because uh, the uh, chompy skull guy, uh, you can't, d that was, that was a dirty trick. That's why I call them troll bombs. Um, ooh, ooh, Jacob Slider. Oh, oh, I got this before. Oh, it was so overpowered last time I got it and it's overpowered now. Basically, I shoot out uh, static tears that uh, when they collide with the wall or with an enemy, Ow. Uh, shoot out electricity in multiple directions so you you don't really have to even hurt like you don't even have to hit an enemy and you can inflict damage and that's why it's pretty overpowered anyways uh, there is a better form of this being called the mega bean fart I think and that much uh, no I'm not touching that no, no. This is way better. This, this is just phenomenally better. Anyways, so it does not only widespread damage, but you don't even need to hit uh, your target. You just need to hit a wall or something. You can't hit the floor. That doesn't work. Uh, but it still. Do, do you see how quickly that? That killed everything. Is an amazing item, guys. Anyways, uh, so this is the last half of this run. Unless I die, then it's going to be the start of a new run. On top of the last half of this run. That's part of this run, that is. Anyways, I'm here with Kane. Uh, doesn't he look lovely? Oh, yeah, I, um, wow, I have a lot of bombs right now. Again, that would probably worry someone very much if I were to say it in a real life scenario. As you can see, I can't really get to those bombs, but these can sometimes have sin hearts in them. It's very rare, but, eh, bit, nope. Nope, something I need to die immediately. Uh, is it just me or does this seem like it's lagging a bit? Oh well. Killing spiders. Because they deserve to die. Die? I said die! Anyways, again, I'm going to be just looking for my item room or a, okay, that guy actually saved me there, a, or a shop. I'm not going to be, I'm going to try not to full clear. Don't need a pill to get that. As you can see, it, the electricity does kind of hurt these, um, these Gela guys with their brains hanging out the back. And there's my boss room, so I know where to go once I find my item room and my shop, because I have a lot of money right now, guys. Anyways, uh, so yeah, once I get those, then I'll go for the boss rush right away. I, I think my computer's really hot, that's why things are going a bit slow. Oh, Wait, yeah, I already have my item room. Huh. That's right, that's where I got Jacob's ladder. Um, but I'm still gonna try and find the shop. I think I have a good idea of where that would be. Ah! As you can see, my fart didn't un my gas didn't um, uncover 
a secret room, but it did kill one of those brain guys, so that was helpful. And uh, there's a toothy door right there, but that would cause me to lose my um, my heart. I think I got a lot of electricity going through me. I have no idea why the game developers decided to um, make Jacob's Ladder an electrical tear shot, but well, there's a lot of about this game that I don't know why the developers did. I have no idea what her hormones does, like pheromones do. I'm guessing if I use that in a room of monsters, um, that would attract a lot of attention my way, which is something I would not want. I think the hermit just takes you somewhere random, but ooh, that's a good damage boost. But I'm gonna go see. Okay, it took me to my own room. And there's the laggy modem, uh, random pills, bombs. I'm gonna take the broken modem and the pills. I found pills. I have no idea what that does. Okay, make that even 30. And kill these two brain brainy guys. Um, again, I'm not gonna full clear too much. I mean, could wait for my bean to charge, but then I would make the video longer. Don't want to do that. Yeah, so eventually I'll get uh, better and faster at this game, so I can do a run in one video. Or at the very least, I'll I'll uh, learn to take as long take long enough to die, uh, so that um, the video can stay short, relatively short. Um, yeah, so I'm not getting anything from those goals, so I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna go. I have a um. 67.5% chance at getting a devil room and a 50% chance of getting an angel room. Not getting that. I'm going to get part over here. Nope. Oh, but there is a crawl space. Oh, these are good. They can have goodies in them or they can take you to a, something similar to a devil room where you trade your uh, red hearts for items or your soul hearts depending on if you have red hearts or not. Or they can just take you to these places which can have random uh, stuff in them. Like that red treasure chest full of troll bombs. Um, yeah, so I didn't find any secret rooms, but uh, it's not too important. I can live with it. Um, Anyways, yeah, so with the broken modem, uh, my, like you saw earlier, uh, enemies will freeze around me. Uh, and so will their tears, so that that can be very helpful. These sisters of uh, this are, um, are, I don't, I don't know what exactly they are. They're monstrosities, that's for sure. I mean, I mean they're in this game, so that's to be expected. As you can see, my devil card works a lot like, um, as you can see, they lagged and didn't fire their, um, their, uh, brimstone as fast or, uh, at the same time as they would. And as you can see, I killed her sister. She would have typically get mad and charge all over the place, but she lagged just enough for me to kill her before she did that. And now uh, I got a snack. Is anyone noticing a bit of a theme with what Isaac has to eat? Yeah, he's not treated well at all. It's very sad. I feel very bad for that guy. Anyways, there's these invisible guys in this room right now. They're very annoying because you have no idea where they are. 
until they're like right on top of you or or whatever. Uh, anyways, the pact damage up and tears up. Uh, I mean, oh, that's just yeah. I don't want it. I want to level skip. I want to be able to get all the good stuff in here. But as you can see, the pact made me into a demon. Demon. Anyways, uh, so now I have a bit more damage. I am pure evil. And I got crap for a gift. Isaac's life is just a tragedy, guys. One like equals one prayer for Isaac and his friends. Oh, jeez. Ow. So, yeah, this room is death. Um, but I got through pretty easily. Yeah, that spot just seems suspicious to me, guys. Sorry. Anyways. Oh jeez. As you can see those skull guys can have mushrooms in them. Or they can... Mushroom monsters in them. Or they can have... Shooty skulls. Uh, which can be annoying. Anywho, and that's a boss rush door. I don't. I have too many hearts. I just, my heart's too big, guys. I don't have the, I don't have it in me to go into those noble creatures' homes and destroy them one by one until I get an item. As you can see, the modem lagged the portal spawns and lagged that brain into not moving. So, that's nice. Oh, hoo hoo hoo. Oh, modem. You sure do love to play with me, don't you? And these guys, they were a bit delayed. That was probably because of the modem. As you can see, modem helps tremendously in these kinds of situations. I have a bit of an OP build right now, and I just realized that guy just regenerated. Margin Boo! Anyways, I'm not using my item, my uh, bomb guys, because that rechargeable bean recharges while I'm in the room. Just continually recharges until it's full. So I can use it as many times as I want in a room, so long as I'm willing to wait. And that can be very helpful. And I'm right next to a shop, or it could be Super Greed. Wow. Wow, that, that guy lagged real bad. Yeah. The, the broken modem. It saves lives. Anyways... Uh, there's a little buddy guy that you can get that I really want to, I really want to find during this run. Um, it's basically Navi from The Legend of Zelda. It's called Yo Listen. And basically it points out all kinds of secrets for you. So you don't have to guess where uh, doors are. Oh, that's the, um, lost contact lens. Uh, that basically gives me a shielded shot, which means uh, my shots can block enemy attacks sometimes. That's very good. Yeah, see? See? Now, now Kane doesn't need his eye patch as much. He just needed to find his contact lens. Anyways, this has been a very fruitful secret room I found. Um. Oh jeez. Yeah, see the, see that um, uh, the barrier around my tears. Those will block shots. Unfortunately, they don't go through. Um, they'll just intercept them and disappear with them. Anyway, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh no! Sorry. 
Nope, 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 nope. Nope. Yay! Wow! That was easier than I expected. Am I the only one who thinks this looks a bit sus suspicious? Yes! Sometimes you just gotta go with your gut in this game. What? Angelic spoils. I don't know if I want that. Because this gives me all kinds of nice things. Anyways. I gotta find my item room, and then find the boss room, and murder mom. That sounds very bad. I think in any other context than playing this game, those kind of things would be unacceptable. Except for finding the item room. That sounds pretty normal. And I found the boss room, which is my mom fight. Uh, will I be, will I get an item room? Uh, still, I don't know. Okay, looks like... I was going to say, it looks like those spikes don't pop up after you kill everything in the room, but I was wrong. I need to learn to stop making assumptions about this game. <sighs> you need to blow up. Ow. And Temperance makes this pop up. Um, basically, I pay life to get get uh, money and stuff. But and that doesn't take away from my devil deal if I do that. But I don't want to. I don't want to do that. It's my blood. I'm I'm not really uh, that kind of guy. I mean I I want to help people, but. Oh. Well, fantastic. And there's Cancer the Crab Zodiac. Uh, what are you supposed to do? HP up and you feel protected. So that's nice. It's a nice little llama. Uh, little deal. Ow. As, I guess that was the modem work, that some things lagged in there. Anyways, now that i found my item room in my shop, I'm gonna go directly to the mom fight. No more distractions, no more delays. Gonna kick butt. For the rest of my days. And I don't need to worry about spikes here, but I'm gonna try and fart here. Yeah, I didn't think there'd be any kind of secret room, but eh, it doesn't hurt to try. Unless, like, there's a fart counter and some sort of penalty if you use a item that makes you fart too many times. And, yeah, the modem caused her leg to stay down longer than it typically would. Uh, froze my enemy's tear for a while. And I got a fart on pile of mom flesh? I don't know. Ow. Well, now you're sick. Hope you're happy. Any mothers out there watching this, don't step on your kids. That's just me. And generally frowned upon him by support by society. Yes? Okay. So, now I can go even further into the scarred womb. Wait! Did you not? Nick. What? Your 
Hello? Okay. Just a reminder. Sorry about that, guys. I'm going to cut that out of the video. <sighs> ah, why'd I get this? I knew what it, I should have known what it was. Ooh, so convert. Yeah, basically, I give up uh, my red health hearts. And I get soul hearts in exchange. Which is nice. And, uh, Nick remembered to cut out that whole deal with me getting scared by my sister knocking on my door. And the whole phone call thing. Wasted my time. So I don't know what the, uh, black pouch necessarily does. I know if I uh, s like circle around it makes pentagrams on the ground like that but I don't know what it does. I don't know what they do. They're basically pointless. Well technically they have like five points. Yeah so as you can see one of my uh, shielded uh, tears um, collided with one of, I guess that holds a door open or something? Not very helpful. Anyways, I have no idea what the pentagram on the ground does. It's kind of pointless, except it has five points. Uh, sorry, trying to retrace my steps to where I was thinking before I got distracted. Um, yeah, so from now on, no matter what happens, I'm going to be taking a whole heart of damage. That is not fun. It is not fun for me. Ooh, this is a dice room. I forget what the two... That's right, it re-rolls everything on the ground. Okay. Uh... Which is why I apparently missed a bunch of stuff before. So I think it is. I don't remember. Anyways, I'm. I think from here I'm not gonna get any more item rooms. So I'm just gonna try and find the uh, boss fight as quickly as possible. Um. Sorry, I can't, I'm not commenting group. This is where the game gets really intense. Can't afford many mistakes here. I just had a hunch. Ow! And if I had a dunk, dark bomb, I'd just get a bunch of hearts back from him or spiders. Okay, that should have still hit him. 
Ow. Yeah, I've had some pretty OP builds recently, to be honest, uh, while playing this game. Am I the only one who thinks that kind of looks like a butt? And why isn't it dying yet? Do I have to wait until it pops up? Yeah, I had to wait until it popped up its head. Anyways, I found the boss room! Yeah. And it's the bloat! First time I've ever seen this guy. Even in my free time, I've never met this guy. And he looks like Peeps. Which is probably why I thought he was a uh, mega fatty. Because Bloat kind of sounds like it'd be another name for mega fatty, doesn't it? I swear I'm not crazy, guys. I mean, maybe a little. Anyways. Ow. Looks like it only did have a heart damage, actually. Anyways, down further in to fight Mom's heart. And if I beat Mom's heart here, I'll have a chance to go into a devil room. That takes me directly to Shoal to fight Satan. Again, I've done all of this on the other save game you saw. So, this is still new. Yeah. Anyways. I lost what I was going to say. I had three minutes to finish this episode, so I might not go to show. And of course, my first item was just spiders in a box. What are you? Oh, by poison bomb. Gosh dang it. Ah, that was close. Anyways, uh, that lump of mass I just fought was a boss, and now Chubbs is a boss here. And is it he lovely? As you can see, Jacob's ladder is very helpful in most circumstances, and it helps me kill enemies very quickly. Oh, wow, three bosses this time around. Hey, Loki! Been a while. Not really. Just saw you yesterday. Anyways, so yeah. Shielded tier. Shielded tears, man. They're very helpful. So is Jacob's Ladder. Uh, which, if you don't know, um, Jacob's Ladder is the story of how, A, Jacob's name got changed to Israel, and B, it's the story of how, okay, I guess that double activates my item, my spacebar. Sorry guys, I've gotten that before, I still didn't know what it did. Tested it out, wasted it. Uh, Patrick says these things look like diglets. I kind of agree with him on that. They look very much like diglets. Much less so now with the loan form and all, but... Eh. Um... Anyways... This is ever so slightly annoying. I don't really need bombs that much right now. Got like eight of them, haven't had much reason to use them because I have my bane. Yay, soul hearts! I need those. 
Anywho. And that's my timer. Uh, but I'm still gonna continue to the end of this run for this episode because I'm very close to the end. Um, if I do decide to go to show, I probably will do it in a different episode of this. So, like, after this mom fight will be the end of this episode, if I go to show, I'll continue this run in the next episode. Anyways, who the war card? And I'm very close to the boss room, but there's also a secret room that I want to check out. Um, hmm. Sacrifice pit. Nope. So basically what happens in uh, Jacob's Ladder when he gets his name, he wrestles with God, um, at least as far as the story goes. Anyways, uh, he apparently wrestles with God, won't let him go until he's blessed by him, and um, ends up uh, getting his blessing that he wanted change his name to Israel uh, but before that um he has a dream where he sees a bunch of angels going up and down a ladder into heaven so okay the Emperor will take me directly to the um, boss room since I already know what that is and I don't have anything else to challenge me in terms of getting there I have no reason to use it, <coughs> but I probably will still use it. Just make things easier for me. Yep, there's Mars Bond's heart. Things you'd never expect to say. Uh, as you can see, that is literally a beating heart. Presumably, our mom's heart. Surprised it's not smaller and all shriveled up. Ow. That is very rude, Mr. Eyeball. I don't understand the eyes, guys. I mean, they shoot these uh, electricity at you, but I don't know why they're here. Anyways, Mom's Heart is very, very easy fight, and made a lot more so with you to tears. Thank you, lost contact. As you can see, farting on her was pretty effective. <laughs> but she can't call friends. Like when she wasn't just a heart. Okay, so now she's getting a bit more desperate because she's lagging. She can't fight as effectively. Uh, looks like I can't go to show, guys. So, this is going to be the end of the episode. Um, as you can see, there's a big golden chest that I can jump into. So that will end this run. Until next time, guys, I will see you on the other side. And the cutscene. I believe this is going to be the easy one. Anyways, that will be the end. See you guys.